Now with 100% more ducks. Howdy folks, Grok the Duck Farmer here, floating in the void of the FTG server, playing Feed the Beast Infinity Evolved Expert Mode. And yeah, if, if you s wondered what I'm doing here in the void, you know, the last episode I was making a big reactor. And there's the big reactor. And happily, uh, I have gotten all the fuel rods in place after loss, losing four stacks of them over the edge. Uh, how exactly? Well, if what I was doing is I was pumping the materials to me here in my ender chest and there's this fun bug that occasionally happens where you say gimme and instead of it giving it pitches it over the side as if that's useful in any way but uh, so I was grabbing it grabbing it grabbing it and then I came up to grab the next stack and it took the entire ender chest worth and went over the side and I watched it go bye bye and I went <laughs> so uh, anyway, so I've got a lot of the stuff uh, set up here. I still need to fill a lot of these individual pieces, but I'm letting the liquid, uh, the gelid cryothium go ahead and pour through this floodgate to fill the main piece now. And it's been running, oh, probably close to an hour and a half. And you can see it's done three layers. So this is going to take a good chunk of time. I'm guessing overnight, maybe a bit more, but uh, yeah, this is proceeding. So we're going to do some other stuff while this is doing its thing. Well, back at the blood magic area, I have this little area next to my binding ritual set up for summoning elementals, uh, but we're missing the arcane plinth in the middle. And I want that because I have here the stuff I need for the tier 5, and so yes, this is a tier 5 altar, uh, but I really want to get some of these upgraded runes for the superior capacity so my network can hold gobs of stuff. Uh, but the problem is I can't do that. Uh, what I need to do, let's take a quick look here, uh, orb. To get the next tier, the Archmage Orb, I need the Demon Blood Shard, and that I can use the Archmage Blood Orb, and that will allow me to get the Rune of Superior Capacity, because it needs the, the tier f 5 or greater uh, orb. And so I, I, I can make all the rest, that's not a problem, but so I need to summon a Demon. Well, in this case, an elemental. But the problem with that, to make the arcane plinth, there it is. These guys were easy, because it was just taking an arcane pedestal and tossing it through, and boom, it's converted. But no, I need to make this, the arcane plinth that goes in the center, which means two of these plus a null catalyst in an elven trade. So that's that's the, the gateway... And so over here, I've got things almost ready. Uh, two mana pools, uh, Natura Pylon, I've got sparks on top so that they can grab uh, energy fast. And yeah, Glimmering Living Wood, but this right there, that needs to be the core piece. So let's go down the rabbit hole and see what we got here. This is the Elven Gateway Core. All right, Living Wood got that orb, no problem. I already got me an Ender Dew, that was just a distillery, uh, so that was no issue. Terra Steel, Soul of the World. Uh, it's gonna be interesting. Well, I can make this, got that, got that, got that. Uh, I can make one of those redstone soup. Okay, so that's some more bits there in the kettle. And once I've got that, plus the Primal Charm, I don't have that researched. But while we're talking witchery, let's zoom up here. I went ahead and made a double circle uh, around my altar uh, and moved the cauldron into that. I got a comment saying that that should help get rid of a bunch of the the weird effects like I got stuck. Uh, other times I've done potions I've seen I'm stuck there and I can't move and mobs keep coming in. Uh, they don't do anything but they, they look like they're there and you can't hit them 
Um, but yeah, it was loads of fun. And let's see, we're up to 13,000. I showed off the dragon egg when I put it on there. Nothing seemed to happen. After a little bit, when I, I looked at it again, it went up 1,000. So yes, that is useful. Uh, you know, if I fill the chalice here from the palace with the brew that is true, that should increase... Uh, either the power or regen, I can't remember which, but uh, it's worth taking a look at. Yeah, it's working, but I'm going to have to uh, start making me some soup. Make me some redstone soup, and then I can sit there and make this soul of the world. Alright, so I need some string, mana string to be precise. There we go. Mana infused string. Let's come to this little crafty table. Plop, plop, plop. There is the kettle from witchery. Let's head back up to the witchery spot. And of course it needs water and and uh, also is that water going in there? It should be getting water from there. Oh, uh, do I have to use a... Huh. So it'll take water that way, but it won't take it from there. Well, fine. Anyway, uh, stuff to do. Um, redstone soup and elven gateway core. That's the main thing we're looking for. Uh, the soul of the world. Nope. I need redstone soup. And in fact, to make the elven core, I need the soul of the world, which needs two redstone soups. So I'm going to make two of these. They need to go into the kettle. And I should have everything here. Oh, wait, I don't need these. Uh, I am missing that piece right there, which is the drop of luck. And to make that, Mandrake, Netherwart, Tear of the Goddess, Refined Evil, Mutendus Extremis. Well, I made some of this. Uh, refined evil. Well, I need a diamond vapor and gas tier, and the good news is I've got that here. So there's my two. That should do me, and this, the stuff just gets tossed in if I am... No, 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 no. Let's, let's look, 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 look again, just to make triple sure. This is cauldron. This is cauldron. Okay, so let's not mess up. And so, one of you, and one of you, and one of you, and one of you, and one of you. Oh, we got the swirlies, so that's always good. I wonder if we're going to get an effect. I've been dealing with several effects, and, you know, they're, they're kind of interesting. There we go. One. No effects. That's nice. All right, so let's do a second. Doop, 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 doop. And in it goes. And there's a reason why I'm making two soups. Uh, one of them will go into the Elven Gateway core pieces that I need, but uh, there, there's a good reason for the second soup. And are you done? Anytime now. Feel free. Yay! All right. So uh, I've got two here, and so they go there. And I also need, from what I understand, a bottle. So let's grab a couple of those. So if we take a quick look at, nope, nope, here. Uh, if we take a look at the redstone swoop, then this goes into the kettle, redstone, tongue, drop a luck, belladonna, willabat, and the mandrake root, which is exactly what I got here. And I was reading that that needs to be smacked with the bottle afterwards to get what you need. So let's drop in the bits. Boot, doot, 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 doot. They should all be in. Uh, I'm hoping that's good. Burble, burble, burble. Can I just smack it now? I can. There's my redstone soup. Okay, cool. So uh, that will work. Let's hit that with some water. And let's do that again. Ooh, I can actually stand on top of it. Okay. So doot, 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 doot. And green happy bits, I guess. Bloop. 
there's my two redstone soups and I wanted the two if we take a look oh yeah it's really chewed <laughs> down a lot of the the altar power uh, 13k altar plus four let's take off my chalice from the palace and now we're going to make a brew that is tr hey hey you're supposed to work oh it's actually shaped okay well let's put that on top there now we have the chalice from the palace with the brew that is true nope I don't want to click on you Ooh, sparklies oh yes that that bumped up <laughs> 3,000 extra points so that's nice and it's got the nice little sparklies of blood coming off of there. Cool, cool, alrighty. So, uh, that, I've got uh, the redstone soup, which is necessary for the elven gateway, but I'm not even there yet because I need this first. <laughs> and I still need to research the primal charm. I'm getting this weird flickery, flickery, flicker, 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 because it's putting a little text there. So, all right, soul of the world, I can make these things. Now, I, I have not researched the Primal Charm. And if we take a quick look, Primal Charm, here it is. But I've got the recipe. And it turns out, if I take a quick look, because I was going, I, I have not researched it. Well, here underneath the Artifice ta tab, it's the very first thing right in the center. Boom, Primal Charm. It does need some demonic slates, so I just ran two through and then 25 of each, so that's not a problem because I got that right here. So let's stick those right there. Primal Charm. Alrighty, so we need that. And let's go ahead, now that I've got the Potion of Regeneration, my Attune Stone, and Golden Apple, which I didn't have before, let's go up. And uh, it's good that it's night because I, I figure that witchery stuff is extra good when done at night. Because, you know, evil, scary witchery stuff. Uh, let's grab. I should put away my sacrifice dagger. Dagger of sacrifice, you know. Anyway, so. Uh, let's triple check. Soup. Soup. No, no, no. I don't want to use that. Uh, can I. You know, it does not have the recipe for that there, but no, it's it's the Elven Gateway is what I'm looking for. I need the Soul of the World, and it is Kettle. Okay, I wanted to triple check that it is going into the Kettle, so boom, 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 boom. And that was the uh, bottle, 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 I have no bottle. Bottle, bobble. Let's grab one of you. Oh, let's grab two just in case. And let's go boop, boop. Oh yeah, I did need two. <laughs> it's a good thing I did that because the first one would not have worked. Alrighty, so I have that. How much did that chew down? Eh, just like a couple three thousand, or it's still going up. And let's go ahead and oh, there's the uh, ember moss. I used a whole bunch of the mutandus around here and, and that popped up, so that's new. Oh, and I have a uh, uh, an actual belladonna that's not from Agricraft, so that should also help. And down we go. <laughs> I, I, for some reason, I find that loads of fun. Okay, so here we need to make the elven gate cube. That piece right there. Ba-dump. And, oh, of course I am missing my orb. And does it have to be Magician's Orb. Magician's Orb. Do I have to use Magician Orb? Why can I not use orbs that are higher? <sighs> Silly. I wonder if it consumes the orb. Wouldn't that be fun? Uh, where's my Magician's Orb? Let's look at the thing again. Magician's Orb, that's the Thaumium, that's the Tier 3 Orb. I, I should have that. I should have that someplace hiding. It's not here. Yeah, I made a second Master Orb. That way I could toss it in places. Um, um, I do not know what happened to my Orb. Let's triple check. Orb. Nope, nope, I have just the, the weak board. Okay, well, fine. We'll make another one. Thaumium. You go away. 
give me you. Why? Why did that? Eh, I have no idea why that disappeared. All right, let's edit this so it does not disappear. Thump. Alrighty, and so I may speed this up. There's my magician's orb, and I'm gonna bind it to myself just because. I don't think it really matters for the recipe, but you know, I could have just used my translate, but yeah. All right, so Elven Gateway. Fine, I'll stick you in there. There's my Elven Gateway core. All righty, let's go ahead and light that bad boy off. That comes over here. These pools are empty. Um, they... I think they will come from elsewhere because of the sparks. So, wand, wand, wand. Who has a wand? Where is... There's my wand. You can go back up. Don't need you. And let's see. Are you pulling enough? Nope, because there's not enough mana in here. Fine, let's go ahead and you go here and you go here. All right, we'll let those uh, shoot off stuff for a while. You can go there and uh, you can go there too. All right, I'm gonna have to uh, get some stuff spreading around here a bit to get some mana into these things. It's gonna take a bit. Why oh, you know work sparks? I think I've got enough mana here. I've got these top three and this one all pumping mana into here, and it's a little bit more than an eighth. And then this one has three here. Yeah, those two and that one, and this one has more, which you know, yeah, go figure. So that should be done, and I have the stuff I need for my arcane plinth, and then some other stuff that I can toss in real quick if I still have mana going. So going. That looks like it's up and working. Cool. I'm gonna stand here and toss that. There, I've got my upgraded one. Let's go toss, toss, toss. Yay, toss. And uh, this next little bit is gonna take a little bit longer, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut. Yay! All right, good, 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 good. But what I really wanted, now I, you know, I think I may just be able to leave these guys going. Uh, they're not going down. Ah, I'm just gonna let it go because what's the use of having massive mana reserves if you can't use them? So I'm gonna use them. So you go away. I don't need you. You go right there in the middle. Plop. And I need the bits for. Yes, I need one more incendium, and that just needs a lava bucket there, and we'll let it do its processing. You can see the items here. And done. Now? Yes, thank you. And I do like that it gives me back my bucket, you know, precious bucket, and I need that orb. Okay, so, fun, fun, fun. Let's go ahead and try killing us a fire elemental. So let's put those there, and then you go there, and we'll get a little bit of uh, lightning. And I think I'll probably just chop him with my sword. Oh, nope, nope, I need my bound blade. Let's kill him with the bound blade. Because I want the, the blood shard. All right, there you are. Hello, mister. There you are. Stop flying out of my way. I want to kill you. There. You are just annoying in your moving. Stay and die. He's got like 40 some hit points left. 18, no, 7, dead! Oh, oh, dead! Ah! No shard. <sighs> Alright, gotta make some more incendium. 
Alrighty, there's my six new. Grab my orb back. And let's try take two. Stinking elemental. Alright, there's my blade. Turn him on. Elemental. You're not supposed to be so stingy. You're supposed to give me your good stuff. Hello. I shall call you Frank. And I shall kill you. Because I don't like you. Your brother was obnoxious. Hey, but, but. Where are you? Where are you? There you are. One more hit. Nope. Yay! Got my demon blood sharp, which is what I've been dying to get. Well, not dying because I'm so cool. All right, let's toss that in there, and let's let that process. And I'm gonna need the dagger sacrifice real quick. I can just see the blood going down. I didn't even check to see what the amount of blood I need in my altar, but that's okay. I have all these friends who are just dying to help me. You can help too. No oh, man, you can just see it go down. Hey, beekeeper, you're kind of in the way. Oh, done! Yay! I've got my Archmage's Blood Orb. Alrighty, that's what I've been dying to get. Well, again, not dying, because too nice. Yay! Alright, let's park it right here, and I think we'll be done for the day. Oh, so much work. But I am loving this. This should make my my uh, blood network so much bigger. And uh, next, to set up a whole bunch more runes there, uh, so that I can go ahead and get the uh, Tier 6 ritual going. And um, Link and I were actually talking about uh, going in together on that. And I think that would be a blast. But that's for another show. Right now, I'm going to go play with my orb. This is Grok the Duck Farmer here on the FTOG server, playing Feed the Beast Infinity Evolved. Expert mode. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye.